Hi everyone, welcome to the Games for Our Future Game Jam 2020. This is Elif Sudar from Department of Multimedia Informatics, Middle East Technical University. And I'm your uh, research mentor uh, during this uh, Game Jam and I'll try to do my best to help you. Before that, let me show you uh, my research interest. Uh, my main research interest is on serious games and their applications on uh, virtual reality and mixed reality. Uh, on serious games, uh, my main motivation is rehabilitation, like stroke rehabilitation, neglect, Down syndrome, dyslexia. And also we are working on AI, uh, on video game testing using agents. Machine learning and biomechanics are my, my other uh, research interests. So when we are talking about serious games, we are talking about games that do not only aim for entertainment, but they have some other motivations. These can be education, training, rehabilitation, but actually I do like transformational games definition of uh, just shell more. So what he says is that how games change us is not a trivial question. For the answer to it is transforming society as we speak, either for the better or for the worse. So uh, before this game jam, I really do suggest you to think about how you would like to transform the society or, or uh, player uh, so that the future will be a better place. But when we are talking about transforming people or society, we are actually doing something wrong. Uh, in general, we are trying to scare people. We are trying to show them that oh, the future is going to be terrible if you continue like this. But the thing is that it's not working. So what we should be doing is that we need to motivate our player and our user using positive news or feedback, reinforce immediate rewards, monitor their uh, progress. And this is a wonderful uh, TEDx talk by Tally Sherrod, and she explains how you can do it. And these uh, strategies are quite applicable to games, so I really do suggest that during this weekend, uh, you do apply these strategies. What can be some of the game concepts that you can apply during this game jam? You can try to aware, uh, increase the awareness on climate change. You can try to introduce healthy habits. This is one of uh, the examples from our students where we had developed the Save the Ga uh, Planets game. It is a mobile game where you are trying to feed the necessities of the planet, so to, to increase uh, awareness. Uh, we are not only working on the uh, planets, but we are also working uh, in close collaboration with the Metro Department of Architecture, and we are doing um, building information modeling in a mixed reality and virtual reality. Also, we are working on basic design in uh, virtual reality with uh, Weekend University team. Also, uh, there is this H2020 project, ENOD is European Network of CBR and Training Centers, where the main motivation is to create an, a framework of uh, EU network, a, a web-based uh, information platform, and there are 16 joint activities. And as Meta team, our responsibility is to visit all those joint activities. As for example, this is a scenario from NIM, and to implement all those scenarios as video games, uh, also uh, not only in uh, PC but also virtual reality. And in order to do that, uh, we had developed a scenario-based uh, video game generator so that uh, we can easily uh, implement these scenarios, real scenarios given to us, and implement them as games. To do so, we are uh, working in close collaboration with the Unity Animator Controller, and we are using the state uh, diagrams to activate the actions and the state changes. By doing so, by uh, mainly changing very simple game objects, it is very possible to create the games that you see on the second row. Uh, I would like to give you some references if you're interested in serious games. They are mainly on rehabilitation, but also uh, virtual uh, heritage. And these are the uh, references on virtual reality and mixed reality. As I said, I'll be available during this game jam to help you as a research mentor. I'm also available via uh, Twitter and email. So please uh, contact me and uh, try to learn as much as you can during this game jam. But also please do not forget to have fun. Thank you very much.